Hey love bugs, this is Roz. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. And namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you've been coming by my channel and have been watching my videos and have not yet, please like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell. And even if you're comfortable enough, drop me a line or two. I'll love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even give me a thumbs up, like, and even share. It will be greatly appreciated. And for everybody is, I'm, I'm cutting my intro short now. So it's just for everybody is namaste. Love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And today I'm listening to 432 hertz of strong, positive energy, deep, the deepest healing miracle tone. Cosmic. Cosmic, I'm um, sorry, Cosmic Zen Meditation Music. So hopefully you, if you love stuff like that, this is very, oh my gosh. It, I mean, it just, it clears your mind and your thoughts when I listen to this because I was meditating and praying, praying right before I did my video. So if you like stuff like that, it is, will be in the description box below. So, the video I'm about to post today for my content is uh, Twin Flame 101, Hey Ocus, In Pursuit of Happiness. Yes, In Pursuit of Happiness. You know, a lot of us, as in myself also, um, have, you know, if you have lived your life in grief or turmoil or just anything negative, and it's just your happiness is short-lived. You know, we have always been in pursuit of happiness. But the big question is, what makes you happy? You know, I always had to ask myself that. You know, and even friends would ask me, what would make you happy? What will make you happy in a relationship? And I really couldn't tell them because I've never really truly experienced that. You know, and even if I did, it was very short-lived. So it was just like I had to know what would make me happy but it was just like I couldn't find that in other things I couldn't find that in other people I had to find that within myself so that was the things that I've been learning and you know healing from each and every day learning to love myself loving you know knowing that if you love yourself enough other people will love you too so it's just like when we're on this pursuit of happiness, you have to do the things that you enjoy. At least try to do at least two things that you enjoy a day. You know, I know you have to, you know, work every day, um, take care of your bills, take care of your children, or, you know, take care of your, your, your parents or whatever. Or you could be still in school. So you have to take care of you first. Take care of your, you know your necessities first and then but the things that you actually enjoy in yourself put that joy back into your life or try to find that joy in your life do the things that make you happy you know the pursuit of happiness the definitions to be able to it is it's the declaration of independence to be able to live in joy and love without being you know without uh hurting others or yourself you know making sure you live in the right you know in the right path you can be able to enjoy yourself because there are some people that actually put their their misery in hurting other people and that's how it makes them happy but you shouldn't do that you know that's that's things that you need to heal from um being a bully and stuff like that you know you, you have to not do that because it's insecurities that you're lashing out on other people that you know if people can see it for what you truly are it's insecurities that you feel about yourself that you're pushing out on other people so it's just things that we all need to learn for ourselves you know what makes me happy you know when you find out the things that make you happy and you know you feel like you're not in a relationship and you're trying to uh you know better yourself to be in one you have to ask yourself what things do you would you accept what things that you're not going to accept what things are you willing to compromise with what things do you want to have in a relationship? It's like when I think about the things that makes me happy. You know, I like to dance. I like to sing. You know, I like to make, put smiles on other people's faces. I, I love healing. I love learning more about myself, learning more about other people. Um, being artistic and writing 
you know, writing down my thoughts and my feelings. So it's just like, you know, I'm learning more about myself. And it's just like signs and synchronicities come along my path, even when, you know, the confidence, the confidence gets low, you know, because it's just like on that self, you know, that self healing on that self worth. You know, you will find out so many different possibilities of things that you never thought you were able to do before when you find that happiness within yourself. So don't try to, you know, find happiness in, in relationships or try to find happiness within other people. It has to start with self first because if you're not, you're never going to be satisfied. So hopefully you are able to resonate with what I was saying in my video. And you enjoy what you what you heard like and subscribe hit the notification bell be you send out as much love and light as, as possible you know you see somebody's frequency low and if yours is low try to raise it up to group as quick as possible <laughs> and, and send out as much positivity as you possibly can become with one with the universe and i will talk to you later keep me in your prayers and i definitely will do the same for you uh, hit that notification bell, like, and subscribe, and I will talk to you on my next video. Much love. Peace. Wow.